Lord, open our names, and we shall praise your name. A mighty God is the Lord, come let us adore him. A mighty God is the Lord, come let us adore him. Come bring our joy to the Lord. Hail the God who saves us. Let us come before him giving thanks. With songs let us hail the Lord. A mighty God is the Lord. Come let us adore him. A mighty God is the Lord. A great king above all gods. In his hand are the depths of the earth. The heights of the mountains are his. To him belongs the sea, for he made it. And the dry land shaped by his hands. A mighty God is the Lord. Come let us adore him. Come in, let us bow and bend low. Let us kneel before the God who made us. For he is our God and we, the people who belong to his pasture, the flock that is led by his hand. A mighty God is the Lord, Come, let us adore him. Oh, that today you would listen to his voice. Heart not your hearts as a mariva. As on that day at mass or in the desert, when your fathers put me to the test, when they tried me, though they saw my work. A mighty God is the Lord, come let us adore him. For forty years I was weird of these people, and I said their hearts are astray. These people do not know my ways. Then I took an oath in my anger, Never shall they enter my rest. A mighty God is the Lord, come let us adore him. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to his Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts both now and forever. Amen. A mighty God is the Lord, come let us adore him. Father, we praise you, now the night is over, active and watchful, Stand we all before you, singing we offer prayer and meditation, thus we adore you. Monarch of all things, Fit us for your mansions, banish our weakness, health and wholeness sending, bring us to heaven, where your saints united, joy without ending. All Holy Father, Son and Equal Spirit, Trinity blessed, send us your salvation. Yours is the glory, 
gleaming and resounding through all creation. I will sing to you, O Lord. I will walk in the way of perfection. My song is of mercy and justice. I sing to you, O Lord. I will walk in the way of affection. O when, Lord, will you come? I will walk with blameless heart within my house. I will not set before my eyes whatever is base. I will hate the ways of the crooked. They shall not be my friends. The false-hearted must keep far away. The wicked I disown. The man who slanders his neighbour in secret, I will bring to silence. The man of proud looks and haughty heart, I will never endure. I look to the faithful in the land, that they may dwell with me. He who walks in the way of perfection shall be my friend. No man who practices deceit shall live within my house. No man who utters lies shall stand before my eyes. Morning by morning I will silence all the wicked in the land, uprooting from the city of God all who do evil. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and forever. The God who is, who was, and is to come, at the end of the ages. I will sing to you, O Lord, and I will walk in the way of perfection. O Lord, do not withdraw your favour from us. Blessed are you, O Lord, God of our fathers, and worthy of praise, and your name is glorified forever. You are just in all that you have done to us, for we have sinned and lawlessly departed from you and have sinned in all things. For your name's sake, do not give us up utterly and do not break your covenant. Do not withdraw your mercy from us for the sake of Abraham, your beloved, for the sake of Isaac, your servant, and Israel, your holy one, to whom you promised to make their descendants as many as the stars of heaven and as the sand on the shore of the sea. For we, O Lord, have become fewer than any nation, and are brought low this day in all the world, because of our sins. And at this time there is no prince or prophet or leader, no burnt offering or sacrifice or oblation or incense, no place to make an offering before you, or to find mercy. Yet with a contrite heart and a humble spirit, May we be accepted, as though it were with burnt offerings of rams and bulls, and with tens of thousands of fat lambs. Such may, may our sacrifice be in your sight this day, and may we wholly follow you, for there will be no shame for those who trust in you. And now with all our heart we follow you, we fear you and seek your face. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O Lord, do not withdraw your favour from us. I will sing a new song to you, O God. Let 
Blessed be the Lord, my rock, who trains my arms for battle, who prepares my hands for war. He is my love, my fortress. He is my stronghold, my saviour, my shield, my place of refuge. He brings peoples under my rule. Lord, what is man that you care for him? Mortal man that you keep him in mind? Man who is merely a breath, whose life fades like a shadow. Lower your heavens and come down. Touch the mountains, wreath them in smoke. Flash your lightnings round the foe. Shoot your arrows and put them to fly. Reach down from heaven and save me. Draw me out from the mighty waters. From the hands of alien foes whose mouths are filled with lies, whose hands are raised in perjury. You, O oh God, will I sing a new song. I will play on the ten-string harp. To you who give kings their victory, who set David your servant free. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. I will sing a new song to you, O God. O come to the water, all you who are thirsty, though you have no money, come. Buy corn without money, and eat, and at no cost, wine and milk. Hear my cry, Lord, for I hope in your word. Hear my cry, Lord, for I hope in your word. I rise before dawn and call for help. Hear my cry, Lord, for I hope in your word. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Hear my cry, Lord, for I hope in your word. Lord, save us from the hands of all who hate us. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has visited his people and redeemed them. He has raised up for us a mighty Saviour in the house of David his servant, as he promised by the lips of holy men, those who were his prophets from of old, a Saviour who would freeze from our foes, from the hands of all who hate us. So his love for our fathers is fulfilled, and his holy covenant remembered. He swore to Abraham our father, to grant us that free from fear, and save from the hands of our foes. We might serve him in holiness and justice all the days of our life in his presence. As for you, little child, you shall be called 
a prophet of God the Most High. You shall go ahead of the Lord to prepare his ways before him, to make known to his people their salvation through forgiveness of all their sins, the loving kindness of the heart of our God, who visits us like the dawn from on high. He will give light to those in darkness, those who dwell in the shadow of death, and guide us into the way of peace. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. Lord, save us from the hands of all who hate us. Our sufferings bring acceptance, acceptance brings hope, and our hope will not deceive us, for the Spirit has been poured into our hearts. It is through the same Spirit that we pray. Stay with us, Lord, on our journey. Help us to realise that our troubles are slight and short-lived. They are as nothing compared with the joy we shall have when we reach our home with you. Stay with us, Lord, on our journey. Come to the lonely, the unloved, those without friends. Show them your love and help them to care for their brothers and sisters. Stay with us, Lord, on our journey. Take away our pride, temper our anger. May we follow you in your gentleness. May you make us humble of heart. Stay with us, Lord, on our journey. Give us the fullness of your spirit, the spirit of sonship. Make our love for each other generous and sincere. Stay with us, Lord, on our journey. At the Saviour's command, and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Increase in us, Lord, your gift of faith, so that the praise we offer you may ever yield its fruit from heaven. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless us and keep us from all evil and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.